What is up, guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred. Today, we should be celebrating because Fortnite is coming to next gen hardware. It's finally had been announced coming to PS5, Xbox Series X, and most importantly, it's making the move to Unreal Engine 5, a brand new engine made by Epic Games that is going to take that Fortnite is going to take full advantage of. And they showed us a little bit of gameplay, not of Fortnite, but of a different game, or a tech demo, if you could say, of a game running in that engine. And oh my god, that game looks crazy. But they did announce that that's not going to be a, a real official game. That it was just a test bed, you know, to show us what that engine can actually look like and games that engine can actually produce. But granted, that shit looks so fucking good. And, and they said that Fortnite is coming to that engine. They said that Fortnite is coming to next-gen consoles. And I wanted to talk about it because, yeah, it, it, that's a big deal. That's a big deal. Now, we all knew that Fortnite, yes, was going to come to the PS5. Fortnite can play on your fucking refrigerator if you have an Android refrigerator. You know what I'm saying? Like... You could, you could basically run Fortnite on a fucking toaster, again, if it was an Android toaster. So, it coming to the PS5, Xbox Series um, X, not a huge surprise. You know what I'm saying? However, woo, you tight. Oh, shoot me. Oh, I see. That's my kill. That's my kill. Um, he has a sniper, right? But where's the guy that's shooting? Oh, he went down. Got him. Fifty-five. Let's go. On. Oh! Oh, I don't have enough fat. Let's drink one of these. Woo! Woo! Gotcha, ya bitch! I was eating top ramen, ya bitch. Come on, move out my fucking way, you fucking stop sign. Woo! You bitch! You fucking... Oh my god. I'm fucking dead. There's no way I make it out of this alive. No way. No way. That's one way. Of course nothing. Won't help out. Oh fuck. Coming through. Oh, fuck. One tap. I'm one tap. Woo! Ya bitch! Fuck out of here, ya bitch! Whew. I still need health, man. So they dropped a press release, they uh, basically said, what does it mean for Fortnite? And they're like, it doesn't mean anything. You're getting the same Fortnite, it's gonna be the same map, nothing's changing, basically it's running on new hardware. How would this take advantage of next generation consoles? We don't know everything about the next generation consoles. We don't know features, like what new features these consoles are gonna introduce. And I think these features are going to be minor. I mean, like, what more can these new consoles introduce that's so groundbreaking and changing to what we already have? Ooh, 
you die. I don't think the next generation consoles are going to, again, have anything that's going to be, like, detriment to changing what Fortnite is as a game that we have to worry about. You know what I'm saying? Like, yes, it might get, like, a new party chat feature or some, some, something under the boat like that. But I doubt it be something that's, like, to the point that we have to worry about it. Oh, here they come. Woo! Come on, I can't see you, bruh. I can't even see you. And that's the same one that got me in the fucking that aim bot. I doubt that the um the consoles will have anything that is gonna be so detriment to Fortnite that it's gonna be an advantage or disadvantage to consoles. I think it's just gonna look better. It's gonna run smoother. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be more frames per second or whatever for a console. You know what I'm saying? I doubt it be something that people will feel that it's unfair or taking advantage of technology too much that other consoles in the previous generation don't have. You know what I'm saying? That at launch version of Fortnite on the new consoles, which will be available at launch, is going to be on Unreal Engine 4. But then once it, you know, Unreal Engine 5 starts rolling around and rolls out completely, it's going to make the move over to Unreal Engine 5. But they're saying mid 2021 so we got a while wait to see that actually coming to fruition they say does your fortnite account progression and items purchases carry over and it says we plan to support cross platform progression over all consoles and everything so basically how it is now if you have anything and you buy anything now it is for your career of fortnite you're gonna it's gonna carry over you're gonna still have it in these brand new PS5, Xbox Series X versions of the game. So basically how it is now, like when when Fortnite came to Nintendo Switch, everything that you had on your PS4 profile moved over. The same thing with your PC profile moved over to the PS4 profile. You know what I'm saying? It all combines into one. So again, that is dope. That is, that's something I personally love about Fortnite. The progression system carrying over. And is that a llama? Oh my god, I for a second I tried to do the um the Call of Duty thing when you press up. Yeah, that is a llama. hundred percent. That is a llama. And will my Fortnite continue to support um other platform current platforms? Yes. Fortnite will continue to support PS4, Xbox One moving forward. It's not they're not gonna turn off the switch to the PS4 version. To the Xbox One version, it's all gonna be the kind of the same thing. You know what I'm saying? We don't have to worry about it switching up on us or forcing us to an upgrade that we don't want to. You know what I'm saying? But also, it's it's important to to know that you know my PS4 version is fine. You know what I'm saying? I don't need the PS5 version, especially not at launch, because I don't I don't as much as I want to spend the money on the PS5. I don't think I'm getting it at launch, to be fair. Oh, come on. You're halfway over there. Let me at least get that kill. Oh, I'll face this fucking sweat. I think I need that. I think I need it. I need the match to fight this. Ah, oh, come on, though. Come on. He knows I'm running for it.
Don't find me, don't find me, don't find me. He went down? He went down to kill the henchman. No, he didn't. Come on, give me a break, bro. I seen it! I seen it! <laughs> GG's, my nigga. And I'm up to 60. I'm up to 60. Up to 60 kills in Pleasant Park. Let's fucking go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for making it to the end of this video. If you're not a subscriber and you made it this far, hit that subscribe button. You know you want to. Join the family. Ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time I drop one of my videos. As well as hit the like button on this video so it can be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family. If you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as Twitter, Instagram, or TikTok or whatever, I'm Daddy Game of Fred on all of those. Again, Daddy Game of Fred, you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my Twitter. Also, on all of my videos, I do answer all comments. So again, if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything, just hit me up in the comment section below. I take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and I love it. And again, let's have that conversation down there. Here are a couple of suggestions suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest. I am a variety channel. I do tons of stuff, tons of Pokemon, but tons of other stuff as well. So dive into these videos. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one.